Right, lesson 88 is on transformations. Now transformations is the way you can move a shape around a space. If two figures are congruent, that means they are the same shape and size as the other figure. These two figures here are congruent, but you couldn't tell it just by looking at them. One way to decide whether they're congruent is to position one figure on top of the other one and see if they line up. And we do that by using translations. So the first type of translation is called a rotation. And that's where you take and you rotate a figure. So you can see in this picture, we're rotating this shape upwards. So it's standing up like this one is over here. Okay, that's a rotation. The second type is a translation. That's when you move or translate sliding um, objects next to each other. So you can see here that we've shifted this object. And the third type is reflection. And reflection is where you flip the figure on top of the other figure. And you can see how it's been flipped. So it's like right here. Okay. So the types of transformations we have are translation, which is sliding it. Reflection is mirroring or flipping it and rotation is turning it. So on this problem, it wants me to make turn um, this, let, this number three, and it wants me to write it after a 90 degree clockwise rotation. So 90 degrees would be making a right angle turn and clockwise is to the right. So I'm gonna take this number, I'm gonna take this number and I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees. And so that's what the three would look like after rotating at 90 degrees. Okay, so on this next problem, it asks, or it says that triangles ABC and XYZ are congruent, which means the same. Name two transformations that would move triangle ABC to the position of XYZ. So the first one is obvious. I have to move it in that direction. So that is going to be a translation. Okay. And after moving it, my triangle would end up looking like this right next to it. And that would be ABC. Okay. So I have, I need to now flip the triangle on top of the other one and to flip it, that would be a reflection. So the second step is to do a reflection of the triangle, which at that point it would put it on top of the other one like this. And then that would be ABC like that. Okay, and that's it for this lesson. Good luck on your homework.